Let's see if the scene is working for the trivia multiple choice. Ah, we don't have a we don't have a chat box on this page. I'm a little stupid. Um, let me get a chat box. Let me just steal one from some from here. Don't I'm playing the task again. I'm sorry guys. Out of out of line. And then I also should get this guy. There we go. Spelunky trivia. I guess that means we are ready to start. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Alrighty. I'm gonna hit the start button on here. I hope everybody is ready. Yeah, this is going to be very fast paced. If you've ever played Kahoot, uh, yeah, you guys should mute the stream. If you're, in, if you guys are in the trivia, you should not be listening to us right now. Yeah, because we're gonna. So yeah. Yeah. I'll give him like ten more seconds before I start talking about the the format of how these questions are organized. But basically, this is some very fast paced multiple choice. They're gonna get more points the faster they go on answering the questions. So very similar to Kahoot, and the top three players will move on to the Jeopardy round, which is my very much my labor of love in within this event. It's I real worked game. very hard on that. All right. Yeah, we're hoping to have a really cool. Trivia experience here. I'm trying out something. Are we, are we ready to start? Yeah, let's go. Uh, okay. Ba doop. Three, two, one. So our first question is: How much is the gold triad worth on the Olmec level of Spelunky Classic? So I'm curious. Uh, if if people want to answer this question in chat, I wanna I wanna know like what people in chat think of these questions also, not just the people who are actually playing. Because I think, yeah, I think I would have got this right. Although I would have, I'm not sure like in a Kahoot format where I'm trying to answer quickly, I might have clicked the wrong one. Oh, I didn't even check the answers. Yeah, oops. A leaderboard. Uh, chocolate got it right and nobody else. Wow. <laughs> Everybody missed that question. Ah. Alrighty, here's this question, by the way. Which of the following deals the most damage to the player in Spelunky Classic? Yeah, so the, there's kind of two levels of trickery to the to the classic gold there. The first is that Olmec has a world five multiplier. Wow. Oh my god! Only Hectic got that question. <laughs> the Alien Lord Psychic. Everyone, class. yeah, they do one damage in this game. They do one damage in classic. Yeah, Next so we decided question. to start off in chronological order. This will get easier once we get to video games that more people know things about. But uh, this is courtesy of Yellow Slug. Uh, you might want to move the scene to the right a little bit so we can see the, the rest of that question. Just, like, crop it differently. No. How much is getting hit by a rock do? Getting hit by a rock deals two damage in Classic if you manage to actually hit yourself with a rock. So, yeah, th these if, if you think these Classic questions are too hard, blame Yellow Slug. I actually deleted some of his even harder questions that Here's he didn't even know the board. answers to. Uh, okay, a few people got that one right. We're almost done with we're almost done with classic. The yeah, bear. Olmec crushing cavemen. Uh, that is also pacifist in the other two games, so that's not too hard to figure out. And our fourth and final classic questions: Which of the following classic rooms is unlocked by rescuing eight damsels? I think this one should be a little bit easier if they think about it. The changing room turns you into the damsel, so. We'll see if they can figure this one out. <laughs> Already all done. Let's see the updated leaderboard. Hectic missed that Ooh. question. <laughs> what? <laughs> Insane. He, he's a little silly. He, he, he's a little quirky. Already, uh... Here's a not a Spelunky classic question. All right, time for Spelunky HD. Four questions about Spelunky HD. First up, how many that journal was... entries are there? I, I know JJG is going to get this one right because he got it right a uh, decade also. See, I told Let's you like people would HD absolutely know chat, the though. right answer to this question. Uh, I should have made it harder. I should have gone with my gut. 
<laughs> oh, you wanted to make it like 110, 110. Yeah, like close numbers because I know yeah. people know this stuff. I'm confident they know. I mean, look, two <laughs> people missed yeah, that question. That, well, we got to have some questions that people actually get right. Come on. Fair enough. I've never even done AG. You don't know they just trust Speth. I mean, you know, that's probably a good call. This one's a good one. I like this question. This is, this is also... Oh, I should have looked at this. This is also a question that was in decades. So people like JJG and Chaco have an advantage here because they uh, had the same question last year. All done. Oh, a lot of people got punked by the 240,000, didn't they? Yeah. Oh, yeah, because, yeah. <laughs> Including the ending bonus, which is not what the question says. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice troll. <laughs> we do a little trolling. We do a lot of trolling. <laughs> this is a fun one. This is a fun one. I don't- is there any other enemy in the whole series that has 8 HP no, besides <laughs> this one? Yeah. I mean, for me personally, like, if I was asked this question, I probably would have been a split between Yama and the frog. Yeah, but... I, I have no idea how much HP Yama's fist has. For all I know, it could also be 8 and the question is wrong. I didn't check. Alright, JJG rising up the boards on that one. Like four right, question, people got number, it right. question number eight. This is the last HD question, right? Yeah. We got to... the drain mech question. Let's go. <laughs> I I swear we're going to find a way to use the item in this question for drain mech at some point. Like that that is what I believe will happen. <laughs> Landmine for now. For now, yeah. Is Sam CB has the it, Sam CB gets bonus points. Alrighty, what's the new leaderboard looking like? Who's in? Who's on first? I'm sure Hectic got that one right. Hectic yeah. is in okay. first place. So Hectic is in first place. Can I? I can't scroll to see the rest of the leaderboard. It's and Aaron of... is also doing pretty well in second, which is cool. Spunky two question this time. This one, this one is a really good question. All right, Cosmic Runners, do they do they know the constellations? Hectic, of course, pretty famous for his CO runs back in the day. I wonder if he knows this. And Aaron, also a pretty big Cosmic Ocean runner. Ooh, I think Chat got this one wrong. Please yeah, state the answer. Wait, does it not show the answer? It does. The... It, it's the green one. And the correct answer is NPC kills. Oh, it's a little small. Yeah, we, we should read them out when... Uh, after each question. It's kind of hard to read. It's green. <laughs> yeah, but the text below it is really hard to read. <laughs> I'm glad nobody yeah, Collie's Favor, just... I believe, gives you the... Red circles the red. around them. Yes. Yeah. Which is different from... The lines are like Criminalis, which is the NPC kills. I, Although not I actually, did not know like, that. <laughs> it's not actually killing the NPCs. It's, they just have to die. Like, if they die in a pacifist manner, it still counts towards the Criminalis constellation. Which is pretty cool. So you can do pacifist Criminalis. How many journal entries are there in Spelunky 2? Now, this one is less easy to know because the tracker in Spelunky 2 does not list the number of entries on it like it does in HD. So I think less people will know this one. But it is, it is uh, a very high number, much higher than in HD. It is 210, Venno is correct. Oh, there's actually, okay. I, I thought they were gonna, okay. I think the 12th person oh. just put it in. Yeah, most people got that one. Yeah. Hey, GC. So let's see, oh, AOK is in second now. Yeah, mo okay. Apparently a lot of people do know that. Okay. Already, or at least are... the numbers okay. were far enough apart that they were able to figure it out. One shot the following is I this is a really this good question. You you cook. Was this a Spencer question? I think yeah. this was a Spencer no, question. This is great. It's like Because the, the Clover does so many things in this game, which is why it shouldn't be allowed in low percent propaganda. Boo hoo. I wrote this. <laughs> uh all done. Who and it is right? pots. 
Yeah, it, it affects chest drops, but it does not affect pots. And it does affect dice also. No! Nobody knows this! Nobody knows that the cloaker affects that. dice because it's completely useless information because you can just whip the dice. Alrighty. Uh, and our final <laughs> Spelunky 2 question before we get into the series wide questions. I think this, this, this is, is a good also one. This a Spencer is like, question, right? Yeah, this is another Spencer question. It's not quite cut content, which is Spencer's real specialty, but it is like removed content. It's kind of along the same lines. I, I appreciate the the Boba for Duat reference in this question, by the way. Wait, Wumper doesn't has never heard of this. That's so funny. <laughs> Leader this board. was removed because the bomb box is more is like better so people were tired of having to like get exactly 24 to 31 favor to get the bomb box from Kali. Yep. On to our on to our Yeah, uh, I, I guess like you have to have been around for early days of Spelunky 2 to know the answer to this. Although I mean the other three answers were I mean it could have been jelly, I guess. What on earth was that noise? I don't know. Cha ching cha ching money money. I'm going to the next question. One. This to jetpack, really. I didn't know it was got it was removed that early in development. Alright, so we're on to the full game series questions now there are eight of these and that is which one doesn't have a secret in the tutorial and that is spelunky 2 yes yeah there's a little classic has little kitty the cat tutorial and... cat and hd has a little classic guy that you can bomb in the wall for and about half of our contestants got that one right i'm surprised people put spelunky hd i thought the classic guy was really well known I mean, I don't know. It, it. I don't think either of them are really well known. The tutorial Easter eggs. I hadn't really heard of them much. Interesting. Question number fourteen. Number fourteen. Spelunky two. Which Spelunky game does not give the hatchet a secondary function? This is a fun one because. I think, how many people in the world do you think know the exact function of the head jet in Spelunky Classic? Like, it's very obscure information and is easily confused with the other games. And it does not prevent dark levels, a lot of people think it does. But it also prevents the ghost and emits light. And Heck got it right, it looks like nobody else near the top. Right now we've got AOK, -okay, Hectic, and Aaron in the top. Okay, most people were able to get that one, actually. I, okay, so it just shows when you change positions. It doesn't show everyone who got it right. Okay, that makes yeah. sense. Um, I know the ghost one. And then Bumper is very close behind Aaron. Or, yeah, right close behind Aaron. They've answered oh, Fink, the same number of questions. I just right. realized Fink joined the, the room. <laughs> <laughs> Ban this guy for 100 years. Get this guy out of here. Uh, next question. Wiki misinformation. Oh, Fink, you really? gotta turn off the stream if you're gonna play. <laughs> this is okay. This is one of the. This is another yellow slug question. I did not know the answer. Well, okay. I would be. I would figure out the answer to this question, but I did not know that the pitcher's mitt in classic does that because whoever picks up the pitcher's mitt in classic or gets something thrown at them. Oh, this is Spencer a Spencer question. This? Okay. Yeah. How do you know that? It, I did not know this information. Yeah, you have to deduce it because, like, you don't know. Ooh, Bobaro moving up into third place after that one. Alrighty. Um, going into question 16 here. This one's... Yeah, it's funny because, like, Kirby, even if you only know HG, Pitcher's Mitt definitely doesn't wow. do that. Then, People yeah. answered this one really fast. Why are more this people This is kind of a fun one. This? It's, it's, it's a little, uh... Think, think too high. <laughs> high, you're kicked. Yeah, my <laughs> close boyfriend. Heck, he's already in the game. Goodbye. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> All 
all time. And that is Spelunky 2, of course. <laughs> little, little, little nerf to Kali. Bumo, by, uh, Bumo enters the top three. Oh my gosh. Ooh. He thought he was going to do bad. I mean, these, it's pretty tough. I mean, I don't know. I think two also It, it to is die. pretty tough to do well in that. I think most of these questions have had about a 50% or less answer rate. I'm very curious to see, like, how many questions the person who wins the entire thing got right. It'll be very funny. Yeah, uh... Question number 17. Yeah, four more or less. And this is one of the questions that we, uh, spoiled today. In the Spelunky Classic segment, we got to see some man trap stomping action. I would assume that most people got this one right. Oh, the question oh. was wrong. Oops. That's my bad. I mean, I guess it wouldn't have mattered. AI issue. Uh, my at a gang chat. I, I messed up. I don't know whoever wrote Spelunky 2. Uh, yeah, wait. I Now I want to know which who, who did answer Spelunky 2. Who got points off of that? <laughs> Why are there... Two more close boyfriends and like this is a disaster. I'm Yeah, I don't know why I they... didn't realize they would put the code at the bottom uh, forever. Yeah, oopsies. So silly. I'm I'm sorry, chat. Uh uh What Shouldn't have relied on a I'm just gonna go to the next question, I think. Note to self don't That's make okay, everyone joined late, so they can't actually win. This is a fun one. Yeah, I gotta keep banning people from my... Oh, yeah, let me show you this. <laughs> because the specialty pools in all three Spelunky games tend to have a lot of items that you might not expect. But one of those is just a little bit too crazy. And that is the rope pile. GC. Oh, GC moving up the ranks. So it looks like it's still... We got Hectic, AOK, -okay, and Bumper, right? In the top three right now? Yeah. Who's, who's in the running still? Uh, okay, so... Like, people who would be realistically within striking distance yeah, of third Barbaro, is... JJG, G JJG GC. Bobro, GC, and Aaron could all reasonably nice. get third. And Shady Brook if he gets every question after this one right. And also everybody else misses them all. Anyhow. Question number number 19. I, I'm a big fan of these series-wide questions like this. So this is a question that uh, which of the following does not appear in all three Spelunky games? So one of these items does not appear in all three Spelunky games. Huh. It's it should be possible to know. But we oh. we did see I will say we did encounter classic vampires today, which will make this question a little bit easier than you it otherwise would be. See the answers question mark? Interesting. Oh yeah, only nine people. I, I uh Oh well. This is that's annoying. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, that's a, that's a same, that's, a, that's, that's a that is issue. a you issue actually. <laughs> <laughs> Who raised their hand? <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> that okay? That was pretty funny. <laughs> I also didn't think it like you. I didn't think you'd be able to join the whole time. You feel me? This is this is a fun question. That is fifty k, one hundred k, one hundred and fifty k, and two hundred k are the answers there. Since Hazel keeps not clicking on it, I, I'm. It's literally open on my screen. You are evil. <laughs> I mean, better answer. I'm a killer. 
Okay. Time's up. You should have put zero That's on That's not that. me. I really appreciate that. Alrighty. Alright, so it looks like we have Hectic, AOK, -okay, and Bumper. For the Jeopardy segment. Very nice. Yeah, really, really Ow. fun questions there. Those were those were tough. Already, um, not the window I meant to stream. Are you streaming your thing? Oh, is that gonna crash Discord? Surely not. Go ahead and get the buzzin live going. Yes, I will. I'm gonna switch back to the transition screen. Okay. I hope that wasn't too unpleasant, how awful that ended up being. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was good. It was good. It would, it, and yeah, Derek, so our top three players, players will be yes. moving into the Jeopardy portion of this. We have a full Jeopardy board and a double Jeopardy board ready to go for our three contestants. That's going to be A-OK, -okay, Bumper, and Hectic. Unfortunately, the third player's name does not start with C. A-OK, -okay, Bumper, and Shektik. Is that like him if he was from the Czech Republic or something? Yeah, Shektik. Very, very nice. You streaming, you are. Let me open And this. so those three people, um, do you want to have them join the voice now? Yeah, we can. Uh, I need a second to... And then get him into the the buzzer room as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah, let me, um... Uh, Bumper, you can choose to blame either Hazel or the AI that we used to help make this No, blame me, I one. forgot to change that one particular <laughs> question. That was, that was an accident. Uh, who were the winners? A-OK, -okay, Bumper, and Heck, you were fourth Thankfully, place. the the question that was not quite right was a question that everybody got right, so it didn't actually affect the scoring very much. Oh yeah, you can move those three in now. Okay. Hello. Welcome contestants. Are you ready for Jeopardy? Are you gonna scam oh. us again with another man yeah. trap question? I, I'm sorry. AI for this one too. If you can't um, accept an apology, that's on you. We, you know? we were we were gonna burn down the entire Discord server. <laughs> that is uh, messed up. Well, thankfully, Discord already did that for us yesterday. So, like, it literally happened in the stream. <laughs> so we Actually, like, yeah, oh, let's yeah. let's bring Kirby in here since she's gonna be our scorekeeper, ah, so yeah. that she can be up to date on everything. Always pick the seed. Sorry, thank you, Wumper. <laughs> Oh, they're still mad about that one. Probably cause, <laughs> how did you pick the worst seeds for that, dude? What in the world? That was sort of like next level bad. Okay. Um. Right, so we'll be we'll be watching through. This no, no. Yeah. It's better. Yeah. This. So you'll, you'll want to uh, click on my stream for just. I guess it doesn't matter. For delay. I guess you can click on Hazel's stream. That also works. Uh, right? That should be the same latency. Yeah. You're going to want to go to this website, you three. And I'm going to DM you the code because people are yeah. evil. Uh, that oh, is yeah. This one we're not putting on stream also, at all. Where's the... You could also DM the website. I don't know which one. It's I, yeah, where's posted, the link? I posted it in... Oh, I posted it in Trivia Organizer. I'm really smart. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so awake and conscious there. Yeah. Um, okay. So I don't know how familiar you guys are with Jeopardy, but the premise here is basically uh, since Hectic got first, he's going to act as our quote unquote returning champion. And he's going Ooh. to be able to select from the board first. And mm -hmm. once you select from the board, one of us will read out the question. And then once the question is finished reading, we will unlock the buzzer and the first person to buzz in can answer the question. If you get it right, you will gain however much money the question is worth. If you get it wrong, you will lose that much money and other people may buzz in. And if you get it right, then you may also select the next question from the board from whichever category you want to. Nice, nice. Appreciate the rundown. Uh, other than that, uh, you must answer in the form of a question, although I will not dock points for it. Ooh, um, coward. 
<laughs> okay, so if we're going by official Jeopardy rules, I should give you a warning in single Jeopardy and then dock you in, sub in double Jeopardy if you still don't remember. <laughs> so, do we answer Fair. like in the form of a question? Is that you got? You got to yeah. do the yeah. what is? Yeah. Ooh, so for example, trap. yeah. If if the question was uh, this enemy can be killed by spike shoes in Spelunky Two, the answer would be what is a man trap? What is a scam trap? <laughs> Uh, contestants yeah, are not um, allowed to buzz in at any time, Fink. That is different from... That's uh, Family or, Feud. Yeah, that would be... Family Feud. Quiz Bowl or Family Feud or various other trivia shows. But Jeopardy in particular, you cannot buzz in until after the host has finished reading the question. Yeah, no interrupts. Are oh, you wearing wow. a nice suit, Lois? <laughs> no, I, I am wearing my pajamas and a hoodie. <laughs> I'm wearing a sweatshirt from Rhode Island. Hood up or down? Uh, down. Mm. You're losing a lot of body heat that way. Think I regret to inform you, but I have probably uh, you are wrong. I have probably watched more Jeopardy recently than you have. Think I can also attest that you are wrong. Think I don't know what we're talking about, but I also Think agree that you're wrong. wrong. <laughs> yep. All right. Um, are we ready to begin? Uh, uh, is Kirby yes. ready for 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 scorekeeping? Do you understand how my silly little Hello, spreadsheet gamers. works. I am familiar with the spreadsheet. All right. I you cannot know. wait to play Jeopardy. Can you try just actually? Like, adding I have money one question before okay. we continue. Yeah. Is the T on purpose? It's Jeopardy. It's Jeopardy. legally distinct. Yeah. It's not. It's it's <laughs> not Jeopardy. It's Jeopardy. Oh, yes. I see. Copyright reasons. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Already. It, Are that... we ready to begin? Yes. yes, I'm ready. All right. So our categories for single Jeopardy today are the cutting room floor. Ooh. You oh, won't no. believe who's on first. Oh my god! I got that reference and bestiary. And if you're not familiar with Jeopardy, that B in quotations means all of the answers in that category begin with the letter B. I see. Neat. And you see, we have nugget, emerald, sapphire, ruby, and coin values for each question. Those are one hundred to five hundred dollars within the small two dwelling. Um, Hectic, where would you like to go first? Uh, bestiary for five hundred. What's five hundred? A uh, coin. Oh, okay. <laughs> for coin. Not actually right, found in the bestiary, this rabbit seems to enjoy chaos, which often includes getting himself killed before you can even reach him. Hectique? Oh, Who is Bag? Man. Correct. That is correct. 500 for Hectic? I did not know. I don't think we can the hear the buzzers <laughs> on. Or no, I, I have them. Yeah, you have them set up. Okay, yeah. I have them okay. muted on purpose. So you'll have to address during the, second during the second half when I'm hosting, you'll have to address the contestants for me because I cannot hear the buzzers. Yep. Uh, bestiary for Ruby. This mostly unkillable enemy frequently gets in the way. It gets in the way in the worm, where it's incredibly plentiful. I, th that looks like Hectic again. I yeah, I th you might need to reset the buzzer by the uh -oh. way. <laughs> Good point. Well, uh, what is bacterium? Yep. Ding ding ding. One billion dollars. Beastie here. Uh, I'm being told that you're, I'm being told that chat cannot hear the buzzer. I that's on purpose. It's really loud. Okay. <laughs> and I, I can't lower the volume of it, and so it'll just. I don't want to deafen them. Or right. myself. <laughs> Alright, ready for the question? Yep. This armored foe, unlike his green counterpart, is vulnerable to the whip, even when he's carrying his signature shield. Bumper Oyster? Who is Black Knight? Correct. Alright, Bumper. Um. Can I do the cutting room floor for coin? Internal files in Spelunky Classic and HD refer to the jungle by this other name, an adjective referring to the rich amount of vegetation it contains. Bob Royster. What is lush? Correct. 
may I do the cutting room floor for Ruby, please? Splunky HD's The Dead Are Restless level feeling almost got, was almost got its own, that's not proper grammar, a journal <laughs> entry Sorry. featuring this synonym for graveyard, which Derek Yu spelled wrong internally. Wow, I don't know this one at all. And that is, <laughs> I believe that is time. Yeah, that is time. It is what cemetery. What is cemetery? Oh. oh. Cemetery. I was thinking of synonyms. <laughs> was it, did he say three E's? <laughs> there are three E's in cemetery. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's spelled cemetery with an A, I believe. No, I think it's spelled cemetery. The A is replacing the second E. I could be wrong. I don't remember. Uh, so who goes now? Uh, since nobody got it right, Bumper will select again. Okay. Can I do... Bestiary for Emerald, please? This common flying enemy appears across the first and second areas of all three Spelunky games, regardless of which route you take in Spelunky 2. Hey, okay. Oh. Bat. Correct. What is bat? Oh, oh, whatever. Right, 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 <laughs> There's your warning. There's your warning. Okay. <laughs> warned. The... Uh, okay, select. I'll take uh, You Won't Believe for uh, coin. You won't believe this glitch I just found to get the Ujadai. No, wait. I just had this specialty item. Oh, wait. I gotta clear the buzzers. Uh, Oh, we got to oh, I hit the buzzer. Uh, oopsies. <laughs> I hit it the second time the fastest. <laughs> this is true, and therefore answer the question. What is the skeleton key? Yes. That is right. Nice. Good question. Um, let's go with I got that reference for coin. The Spelunky series makes references to several real-world religions and mythologies. While Yama and Hundun come from China, Spelunky 2's Tiamat, Abzu, Kingu, Lamasu, and Lahamu are courtesy of this oldest civilization in the world. Bumper? What is Babylon? That is incorrect. Whoa! I'm wrong. Anyone else? Nobody else. Nobody okay, wants okay. to lose 500. Oh. oh. Uh, oh, we lose money? I don't know how this works at all. Um, <laughs> I forgot the name. When I, um, what is... Um, Dynasty? Don't chat. They're spoiling. I'm not sure. Could be wrong. Uh, what did you say? Yes. <laughs> Dynasty? No. Not, no. The correct answer is Mesopotamia. Oh um, my god, I was going to say it too. <laughs> Scared. Um, okay, well, let's go for I got that reference, Ruby. <laughs> the yellow cape in Spelunky in the Spelunky series is reminiscent of a power up in this classic platformer released in 1990. Bumper. What is Super Mario World? Close. That is correct. Okay, I didn't actually. Let's go. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> Can I do... Who's on first for a ruby? This Australian player was one of the first to branch out beyond the basics in Classic, being the first to clear no gold, Tunnelman low percent, and low percent city of gold. Hectic. Who is Bronx Taco? Correct. I had no idea. He's a legend. Me, me neither. Uh, I only knew about the low percent city of gold one. <laughs> um, who's on first for coin? Oh. This HD player is well known for inventing and clearing meme categories like Master Sword, Chain Low Percent Hell, and Landmine Percent. But they also went for difficult challenges like No Gold, Max Pacifist, Chain Hell Percent. Bumper. Who is JJG? That is incorrect. 
Okay. Uh, uh, that was gonna be my answer. Who is uh, Die Die? Oh. Sorry, did you buzz? He buzzed right after the oh. time, yeah. Oh, no, that's also not right. My answer was gonna be JGG. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, do we have a buzz from Hacker now? I'm too scared. Okay. Do it. it. Do it. Oh, it, it was X. I was gonna say brute, so I'm glad I didn't. Ooh, buzz. it would have been a triple. Okay. Uh, yeah, by have, the way, so, you have to rebuzz. To... Yeah. Not uh, just do the one. Oh, do I have to buzz? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So if yeah. you buzz in on the first one, you don't have to force yourself to answer. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. Um. Okay. I, I like who's on first. So do that for Sapphire. <laughs> oh man. If you learned Rebel Skip early on, you might have watched this Canadian player's double rope tutorial. They got consistent enough early on to be the first to clear Spelunky 2's low percent eggplant and no gold low percent Sunken City. A okay? Intol? Ah, uh, who Correct. is Intol? Correct. Good save. I'm not used to this Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing great. Uh, yeah, I said Canadian so people didn't answer Landy or Gugabo. <laughs> you won't believe for uh, uh, Sapphire. You won't believe what I just found in a pot. Is this rare? A okay. No! What is alien? Correct. Nice. The comeback is real. You Zuma must be meme. devastated about I'm that one. I'm so <laughs> devastated. You have no idea. <laughs> okay, let's go for. You won't believe Ruby. You won't believe how I died in this special area. A crush trap spawned right above me. I had absolutely no time to react. Hey, okay. No, come on. Uh, what is cosmic ocean? Correct. Uh-oh. Thanks, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, who's first for uh, Emerald? This player has a habit of learning new skips very quickly after they're discovered, making them the first to clear low percent Sunken City, low percent Hell, and HD low percent Eggplant. Hectic. Who am I? <laughs> Correct. <laughs> uh, who's on first for Gold Nuggy? This extremely prolific pacifist runner was the first to clear many <laughs> challenging categories, including no gold pacifist low percent Sunken City, pacifist Cosmic Ocean percent, and Tunnel Man pacifist low percent. A okay. Who who is TV Robot? Yeah. Wait. Oh, yeah. That's correct. That is correct. Yay. I thought so. Uh, <laughs> uh, you won't believe for uh, the, um, what's it called? The, the emerald. You won't believe what went wrong in this ambiguously named strategy, in this case referring to entering Obzu without dying on 4-3. Mm, come on! <laughs> what is death skip? That is acceptable. Although Aww. we're looking for onk skip. Onk okay, skip I, was, I, I wasn't sure if you wanted it to be onk skip, because death skip is also ambiguous. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> um, let's do I got that reference for Sapphire. You guys are really going bottom to top, huh? You let us. You should have changed go the rules. <laughs> the Chris Knife is a reference to this 1965 science fiction series that also featured giant worms, which received a film adaptation in 2021. Bumper. What is Dune? Correct. Indiana Jones. <laughs> uh, let's go. I got that reference for Emerald. Spelunky 2's pilot is a reference to this game, this other game made partially by Derek Yu, set to release in 2024. Bumper Oyster. What is UFO 50? Correct. And pilot. Pilot's in the chat. 
Um, let's do cutting room floor for gold nug. Spelunky Classics files contain a sprite for an unused item named for this Nike brand shoe, which would have let you jump extremely high. Hectic. What are Jordans? Correct. <laughs> Let's do Cutting Room Emerald to appease Cloyce. <laughs> <laughs> this Ice Cave's foreground decoration gives life to the place in Spelunky HD, but a similar one is unused in Spelunky 2. Bumper oyster. What is a snow person? Close okay. <laughs> Gender neutral terminology. <laughs> you you will get uh you will receive credit for this question. Thank you. Uh, may I do bestiary for gold nug? This enemy's erratic movement patterns make it quite t tough to deal with. And it can be a killer if it spawns on the path in HD. Hectique. What is B? Correct. <laughs> that one feels like a freebie. It's literally the letter. Free, Free B? B? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, oh, you guys oh. thought of everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's, let's get that ugly cutting room sapphire off the board. Internally, Spelunky 2 Sparrow is known by this five-letter word what you become in order to start her quest. Bumper. What is thief? Correct. That has five letters, right? Buzzing too late. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> uh, may I do, I got that reference for Tiny Gold Nug. The level feeling text, I hear snakes, I hate snakes, references this film protagonist and inspiration for Guy Spelunky's character design, who is famously Ophidiophobic. I've never seen that word before. Ah, oh, I clicked early. Hec Who is Indiana Jones? Yeah. Sorry, the answer is actually Iowa Jack. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. no. <laughs> Iowa Jack. Montana James. <laughs> I'm having some decision paralysis here, but I think we'll go if you won't believe. Illinois Google John? <laughs> you won't believe. You won't believe where I found this black market. Right next to the uh, the entrance to this other jungle secret area. A okay. Uh, the uh, what is ca uh, castle? Uh, prompt. Be more specific. Um, what is? Um, what's it called? Uh, secret castle. That is incorrect. He said the buzzer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I was waiting. <laughs> what is the haunted castle? That haunted is correct. Castle. Yes, yes. That, that, that was the name. I can only not give that Sad. to you because there is also Vlad's castle in the game. Yeah, yeah. So castle is not specific enough. I like secret castle. I though. like secret castle. Yeah, too. we should call it secret <laughs> castle. Can I post uh, yes, you may, you may, yes, you may. Yes, absolutely. I don't know if it'll auto mod. If, if it auto mods you, we can let it through. Just if you post the Quiggle Black Market video in chat. And that okay, was, it lets you, you won't post believe it. Nice. Where I found You'll one. never believe. That yeah, so if, if, if you haven't it. figured it out, you won't believe the you won't believe category is based on common posts to the Spelunky subreddit. Yeah, the skeleton key one immediately yeah, made that clear. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, so going into the double jeopardy round, Hectic has taken a pretty early lead, but it's definitely still anybody's game since the point values will be doubled as we head into the ice caves where uh, money is worth twice as much. Oh, no. oh stream. <laughs> this stream has ended cricket noise. Honk shoe. Honk shoe. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. This is. I'm sleeping right now. It's siesta. Everyone break. We'll be back in like 20 minutes. <laughs> no. <laughs> you don't get a break. It's, it's break king. Ooh, Sam brings up a good point. Money is only worth one and a half times as much. This is the Spelunky 2 ice caves. <laughs> um, I, I will I will note we had some very uh, heated discussion about the Mesopotamia question in the chat and whether or not Babylon should have been accepted. Oh, I, I will note that the, the name of the civilization is Sumer, but I I do see... Okay, so who who got this? Who answered Babylon? Who I wrote? did. 
Okay, we're uh, what that was a five value question. So we are going to adjust that score because you're correct that it is Mesopotamian myth and Babylon is a civilization that originates in Mesopotamia during the era in which this myth system was prevalent. Let's so, go technicality. Yeah, we're going to flip that and that is going to make the score a lot closer. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I was I was thinking Sumerian, but I did not double check my work on that. So thank you to, for the mythology knowers in the chat. Well, Neo Babylon. Yeah, I mean it's from it is Babylonian. That is correct. All right. Uh, are we? Are we? I will be hosting this round. By the way, are we ready to start? Everybody can see the board. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, a OK. Okay. Since you are in last place, you will select first in double jeopardy. Our categories to choose from are. Who's that journal entry? Run comments, official oh names, <laughs> catagrams, and before and after. And if you're not familiar with before and after, basically the idea here is there's sort of two answers that um, are close to that are that share the middle word. So, for example, if the question was a new form of bubble skip that makes use of a double jump from Spelunky HD, the answer would be Maz Jump Rope. Oh my god! Because gosh. you're combining Maz Jump and Jump Rope. So that is how that category works, if you haven't watched enough Jeopardy. Other than that, um, I think that is, we're ready to go. A-OK, -okay, you may select the first question. All right. Like, who's that journal entry for coin? It is fragile yet full of vigor, reminding us to treasure every one of life's moments. Hexy? What is eggplant? That is correct. Eggplant. I didn't even think it would be eggplant for some reason. Um, let's do before and after for Sapphire. To complete this challenge, you'll have to carry this Volcana enemy all the way from the start to the end of the game without dropping it once. Bumper? What is low percent fire pot? That is, is that incorrect. Okay, I don't, yeah, I don't understand that one. Hectic. What is low percent? Um, I I was gonna say fire fire pot rock, but that's also wrong. Okay. Uh, a okay. You want to take a chance on this or no? Uh, you don't have to. Oh. Yeah, you don't have to. You fire don't pot lose. low percent. I did buzz. What is that fire is, pot low percent? That is incorrect. The correct answer here is Pet Rock Dog, which is not oh. a real category. Pet, oh, you guys uh, said Volcana Pet first. <laughs> Pet Rock Rock Dog. Got it. Oh. Rock I got mixed up by the question order. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're right. I should have written it better. That is my bad. All right. Uh, so bad. nobody got it right. So Hectique, you may select again. Okay. I, I refuse to stand down before and after coin. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> You'll want to damage boost through Yama's blue henchman to perform this maneuver. What? And that is time. <laughs> that is an off face tank. That one's really good. I really oh my god, that's what is it? Wait, what is it? Ox, Ox face, face tank. tank. This whole category is so hard. I would love to keep it before play. and after Ruby. Let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> this fearsome arachnid will get the drop on you, but you might be able to avoid its cobweb by crawling over a ledge. Hectic? Oh, what is flip hang spider? That is correct. Oh yeah, my that's god. Nice. This is rigged. I, I started right. thinking giant. <laughs> Let's go before and after emerald. A rather important, some might say crucial, maybe even critical part of an all shortcuts run. But you got the item from Yang or maybe Waddler. Time. That is Bruh. silver e split. Oh, these are hard. Thinking, you guys ruined yeah, it by no. making it a meme. I'm like, the <laughs> item. <laughs> Before and after, gold nugget. Go big. We this have to get hybrid one. of two jungle enemies is pretty dangerous. At long range, it'll hit you with a boomerang. And at close range, watch out for its hungry jaws. Hectic. No. What is 
Tiki Man Trap. That is correct. The one that I know and heck beat me to it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, oh god. I mean, run comments, uh, Ruby. When Yellow Slug cut the world record in this triathlon category by 22 minutes, thanks to how much of it is classic, he left us with the wisdom: bomb paste is vanilla flavored. Bumper. Uh, low percent city of no gold? That is incorrect. Okay. Oh, I didn't... What is either? Okay. <laughs> no! Alright. You gotta give me time on this, by the way, Heck. Or Hazel. It's, yeah, it's time. Okay. The correct answer is, what is all shortcuts triathlon? Mm. Oh my god, oh, I'm so mad. triathlon! What am I thinking? <laughs> I, w I was like, oh man, what if it's, um, wealthy? But that's... No one's done that. Um, yeah. <laughs> Okay, run comments, Sapphire. Kinejup wrote Brute Temple on his former world record in this category, recognizing the high importance of getting fast and playable tempo levels to get a competitive time. Time. That is Spelunky HD low percent. I mm. was too scared. <laughs> What, do you think it was no going to be max low or something? I, don't, I was just like, that's every category, actually. Brood is well known for low percent in particular, so... Yeah, that's why I thought it, but I was yeah. too scared. Um, run comments. Emerald. Hectique said, I cannot believe this happened after he got two main world, world records at once with a lightning fast clear of this category. Hectique. Rigged. Um, Rigged. I pray I got this right. What is no gold? Spelunky uh, 2? Yeah, specify the game. Very good, that is correct. I buzzed too early, I was gonna fight Tectic for it. <laughs> <laughs> if I didn't get that one, that would have been rough. Uh, <laughs> run been comments, Gold Nuggy. This category was TV Robot's first ever pacifist run, and Spencer's, and Gugabo's. A-OK. -okay. What is no gold pacifist low percent? In which game? Spelunky 2. That is correct. Clap, 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 clap. Yay. 200. <laughs> let's let's uh, take round comments for coin. Speff wrote April Fools, right? After clearing this highly coveted HD category on April 1st, 2020, thanks to a very unlikely seed. Hectic. What is it? Max Chain Low Percent Eggplant. That is correct. Wow. Uh, Catagrams uh, Nugget <laughs> <laughs> Going mining in some local ravines might help you get the gems you need for this category but make sure not to spawn the ghost What is vanilla score? That is correct Wow, I didn't know what this Wait, one what? was it's anagrams. The blue uh, word you have to... Oh, anagrams. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah, so but I'm kind of... Categories. 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 Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, categrams emerald. This category is truly woke, requiring you to befriend an animal instead of roasting it for extra health. Tactique. What is a low percent turkey? That is correct. Let's keep going. Categrams sapphire. <laughs> You might get caught admiring a titan while you spend upwards of 12 minutes in her lair to complete this category. A okay. Pacifist Abzu? Wait, that no. That is incorrect. Oh, that's very incorrect. Never mind. Tactique. What is draining Tiamat? Correct. That is correct. Oh. Yeah, you did it. Why did I think oh, it was man. a... I have no idea. I just saw I'm a disappointed in like... you, Pumo. For 12... I, I mean, know. you just, I'm just... Spent 12 minutes. Uh... I mean, yeah. <laughs> Good guess. I didn't even think about the anagram, to be honest. I just thought, what's the longest thing you spent? I said yeah. that. And I realized it doesn't work. Anagram Ruby. You'll be among the metallic heavens after dying 999 times for this category. Hectic. What is all achievements? That is correct. Alright, rounded out. Categrams, coin. <laughs> 
Running this unloved category is social torture, as you'll probably waste <laughs> hours of your life resetting for the perfect dupe. Bumper? Uh, what is tutorial score? That is correct. Yes! No, no uh, clean sweep for heck on that one. I, I was too busy Denied. laughing at social torture. <laughs> <laughs> um, can I do official names for Small Gold Nug? This explosive amphibian doesn't actually reference its orange color in its official name. What is Firefrog? That is correct. Don't call it a comeback. Can I do official names for Little Emerald? This blue pointy hell enemy doesn't actually reference its color in its official name. Hectic. What is Devil? That is correct. I didn't know its name. <laughs> I was gonna uh, say Google Google AJE Devil. coming in clutch there. <laughs> official name Sapphire. This mischievous feline's official name contains the name of a larger enemy in the same area, rather than referencing the status effect it gives you. Bumper. What is Mummy Cat? That is incorrect. Oh, it's the... Uh... <laughs> what is the other way around? Cat Mummy. Thank that you, Hack. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I was going to say Mummy Cat, too. Official I name is like... Ruby. <laughs> I was... This sticky blue weapon from Classic packs quite a bit more artillery than its equivalent gun in the later two Spelunky games. Bumper. What is Web Cannon? That is correct. I'm terrible at this. <laughs> uh, let's do official names for gold coin, please. Every Spelunky game has to have its own big fish. Name two of the three official names for these fish. Bumper. What is Mega Mouth? What is Old Bitey? That is correct. The third one is Great Humphead, by the way, not Old Humphead as I thought. Uh, I'd like to do Who's That Journal entry for Small Ruby? An annoying pest. Makes me mad just thinking about it. Okay. Fighter, I got nothing to lose. Uh, that is incorrect. The correct answer is Mosquito. Ah. Uh, yeah, That's no, my favorite fair. turtle entry in the game. <laughs> I don't know. The eggplant one's pretty good. Uh, do I go again? Yeah. Who's that journal entry for Sapphire, please? A lowly creature just trying to make it to the next part of its life cycle. Bumper. What is... Grub? That is correct. Yeah. I was hoping you'd say it's wrong. <laughs> yeah, I was uh, really we would have also accepted it. any unofficial oh, have, yeah. name okay. that clearly represents but it's, it's that called, enemy was, no other enemy. But it's called the journal entry, though. You should get the right name. <laughs> All right. Uh, bumper select again. Uh, who's that journal entry for Little Tiny Emerald, please? This frightening tomb lord emerges from its eternal slumber to protect the temple from trespassers. Hectic. What is mummy? That is correct. Would you like to select the last question? No. Okay. Run comments for gold coin. <laughs> A jackal-headed god who rules over the world of the dead. Hexy. No. What is Anubis? All right. Well done. Now, I will say... You have just barely secured the runaway <laughs> against Bumper here. Just... He almost managed to catch up. Now, official Jeopardy rules would not allow <laughs> AOK -okay to participate in this final question, but that's no fun. So we're going to give AOK -okay one dollar. You may choose <laughs> whether you want to bet your one dollar, or you can choose not to bet your one dollar on the final I Jeopardy. I appreciate it. <laughs> I will choose to bet it, please. <laughs> okay, so I'll go all uh, in. Go ahead and DM me. <laughs> Well, uh, you know, it doesn't matter because the the position, the standings cannot change. So just go ahead and say how much you're going to wager on this final question. I'm going all in. All in. Let's go. This is Spelunky History. Oh, no. Is the category. Do we also buzz in in this case? 
No, this is not a buzzer. So in this case, you will DM me what you believe the answer to be, okay. and then after about 30 seconds, we will decide. Uh, okay. Hectika, how much are you going to wager? Uh, everything. Let's go! <laughs> it all comes down to this. Oh, <laughs> All right, so are you ready to reveal the question? Yes. Ready. I will, I will give you about 30 seconds to, to come up with the answer. The longest standing world record in Spelunky history stood for over 11 years until this person finally broke it. Uh, I will give you 30 seconds to DM me the answer to this question. YOLO. All right, I have received three DMs, so I assume that that is everybody. All right, starting with AOK, -okay, who is in last place. AOK! -okay has answered group, which is the correct answer. Yo, GG. Nice. So that brings AOK -okay oh. from $1 to $2. Clap, oh, clap, clap. Let's clap go. Uh, All right. <laughs> Bumper Oyster. Bear. Bumper Oyster has answered berry mode, which is incorrect because berry mode has never held any world record officially. <laughs> uh, because he is a cheater. We don't say my answer. Oh, no. We don't say, uh, say my answer. Say it. Say it. Tactic answered score and then two question marks followed by HD. I thought it was is... the category, <laughs> not the person. Which is also the wrong category. Oh, it is it's the guy wins. Win. The category guy win, really? Oh. Yeah. The classic eight percent. The world record was a two fifty three by wow. exploding cabbage <laughs> from two thousand and ten to two thousand and twenty one until it was finally broken by Broom <laughs> with a two forty. What an upset. A OK with $2. GG. <laughs> I win. <laughs> we'll we'll mail a... that by a check uh, by Carrier Pigeon. Perfect, that was a perfect, perfect. I didn't expect. <laughs> All right. Nice. I hope everyone enjoyed Jeopardy. Uh, I'm going to go uh, get ready for my hosting segment. Thank you for watching, everybody. Thanks for having us. Thanks, Kirby, for, for keeping having... score. It was fun. Thank you yeah, for giving happened. me a thousand and congratulations to our <laughs> new reigning Jeopardy champion, AOK76. You will one day maybe have to defend that title. One day, hopefully. All right. Bye. <laughs> congratulations on winning. Thank you, thank you. You worked very thank hard. Thank you for, for giving this. me money, by the way, so I could participate. <laughs> <laughs> Police was so, so kind to do that. That was a real good segment. It was. Uh, very, very, very good. Cool. Yeah. Okay, now to figure out the next segment. That's gonna be that's gonna be HD mod showcase. Oh boy. They said they wanted me to switch their uh thing. Hey bumper, are you still here? Yeah, what's up? K k go to the go to the HD mod channel. Do you still have the old version of that layout that you could just send to me right now? Because if they want that, I could switch it in like ten seconds. The one with the chat, yes, Puma, the one with the chat. Oh, this was, wow, that's a really cool picture. This, there's so much good art in here, oh my god.
Find it in a minute. I gotta change it and export it. Uh, okay. Yeah, I I have I have the minute to kill. I have the the. It's not a. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. Uh, actually, I need to to. Are any of the HD mod people here? <laughs> I I have. How do you want to do this? Cause I didn't, you didn't like give me anything, and so I just, I'm assuming I, you're just gonna be in a call, and I'm gonna restream whatever it is you're doing to the stream. That's my guess, or one of you is gonna be live on Twitch. Either or works. I, I just, I need to know so I can configure it real quick. Speaking out to the void, someone's gotta be here. <laughs> Bacon is going to be live. He's linked. Oh, thank you, Gary. Uh, they're in the voice call even lower down. And I need to move all five of them here. Okay. Can they move up to the pit? It would be way easier to move them if they were higher up me when I'm encountering a skill issue. Minimize cat. You're so smart. I don't I don't get it. How are you so good at 